so today i am going to tell you one way through which you can minimize the these problems which arise due to not cramming up and memorizing the tables and how a person can teach his child to arrive at the product directly without actually counting the table now for this you know the base work has to be done from right from the class kg onwards when the child is say about 4 years old and from 4 years to 7 years that age is very very crucial for development of a child in terms of his numerical ability in terms of his being comfortable with handling numbers so there are some essentials which have to be taken care of before the child starts these dodging tables in class 3 onwards so i am going to tell you what are the essentials of dealing with this topic now there are basically two broad essentials which have to be taken care of the very first one is to build a strong base of oral addition and that to oral addition i am talking about oral addition of single digits like you have 6 plus 7 13 and so on if the child is comfortable in adding single digits then this forms the basis of all dodging tables so parents work on your child's oral addition from the base from age 4 onwards 4 years onwards and you have to keep on working for the next 2 or 3 years so that when you arrive at dodging tables the basic concepts and the essentials are very very clear to the child the second one is the tables of 2 to 9 that is again single digit numbers so if the child is having comfort in dealing with the tables of single digits and adding the single digits together then this is sufficient for enabling him to write any product from in between the table of any two digit number say up to 30 now i'll demonstrate how this these two concepts help a child in the dodging tables now this is for the parents for the teachers kindly follow this method to teach the child the dodging tables do not pressurize him to memorize all the tables up to 20 25 30 and so on now first example which i am taking is very small example of 12 multiplied by 3 12 threes are now if a child is asked what is 12 times 3 or 3 times 12 he starts counting the table 12 ones are 2 12 uh, 12 ones are 12 12 twos are 24 and so on now if the teacher applies a small concept now he can teach the child to write this product directly now the product which has to be taught to the child is not actually the multiplication or counting the table of 12 what he has to do is the first step is the number here is 3 so what he does is he writes 3 and puts a zero whatever number is there here he puts a zero in front of that number and then he finds the product of this number with the ones place only he forgets this one and multiplies this number with this only so here comes the tables of 2 to 9 so this is 3 into 2 3 to the 6 and now he has to just add 30 and 6 which will give him 36 and if a parent teaches this well the teacher brings in this concept at the right time in life of the child i think this concept can work wonders similar examples now say 
we have the same table of 12 and he has to multiply it by 7 apply the same concept again 7 so he puts a 7 and a 0 and just he multiplies this by 2 so now he knows the single digit tables so 7 2s are 14 and even when we have to add 70 and 14 the child has to be taught not to add like this he has to do this also mentally and for that again we apply the same rule here the tens digit is 7 tens digit is 1 7 plus 1 is 8 and again he puts a 0 and what is he left with is this digit 4 now it is very easy to add 84 so you see two small steps and the problem gets solved if we have some other number say we have 13 multiplied by 4 now again when you see the number here is 4 so the child has to be told that this 4 has to be suffixed by a 0 and then he has to just multiply 4 by 3 that is 12 and for adding these he has to add these two tens places 5 then again put a 0 and then add this digit 2 so 52 10 minutes of practice of this concept will enable the child to write any dodging table up to 30 let us take some bigger example say we have 14 into 6 now see this number is 6 so we put a 0 and we multiply the 6 by 4 6 4 the 24 now tens digits 6 plus 2 is 8 put a 0 and add this unit digit so 84 let us take one more bigger number so that we are convinced that this method will work out for any larger number also say we have 17 into 5 now we have 5 here so 5 supplemented by a 0 plus 5 7s are 35 see we need single digit tables now for adding this tens digits 5 plus 3 is 8 put a 0 and write this number so 85 see even the parents will feel comfortable while teaching this concept because when you are con convinced yourself about a particular concept you have confidence in that concept and you can confidently teach the child how to deal with dodging tables now let us take one more example of say 18 to be multiplied by say we have to multiply by 6 so now here it is 6 supplemented by 0 6 8s are 48 now 6 plus 4 is 10 put a 0 and add 8 108 more examples say we have 19 multiplied by 8 8 put a 0 8 9 the 72 8 plus 7 15 put a 0 and add this to 152 so on let us try and understand this method now suppose we have a question 21 multiplied by 7 so you are asking the child what is 21 sevens are now it is nearly impossible for the child to count the table of 21 up to 7 or add 21 7 times so this basic method will tell the child a basic thing through which he can tell this product in a matter of just 2 seconds yes 
just two seconds that too without use of pen and paper now what you do here is the first step is to double this number here we have 7 so just double it 14 and put a 0 so it becomes 140 this is our first step whatever number is given here just double that number and put a 0 so that is the first step and now multiply this number with the units place of this number so we multiply 7 by 1 that is 7 and now just add these two numbers 147 is the required product so how much time does it take to do this i think by a mere practice of five minutes you can master this skill and you can write all the dodging tables from 21 to 29 in just two seconds time only with little practice and little patience let us do some more products through this method suppose we have 22 into 8 now what i told you in the first step this number is to be doubled 16 put a 0 and multiply this number with the units place here so 8 to the 16 so 160 plus 16 is 176 let us do more examples say we have 23 6 up see 6 to the 12 put a 0 6 3 the 18 just add 138 things become so simple you know and knowing these methods will enable you to save a lot of time in competitive exams some more examples say 24 9 the say 9 9 to the 18 put a 0 9 4 the 36 here also if you have problem in adding these numbers you can split this and add it comfortably 180 plus 30 is 210 and 6 216 another example say 26 fours are now 4 double of 4 is 8 put a 0 and 4 6 are 24 104 is the answer 27 8 are see 8 8 to the 16, put a 0, 8 7 the 56. 160 plus 50 is 210, so 216 is the product. More examples, say 28 into 5. 5 to the 10, put a 0, 5 8 the 40, 140. More examples, say we have 29 into 3 double of 3 is 6 put a 0 9 3 is 27 add 87 more examples 29 9 is a double of 9 is 18 put a 0 9 9 is 81 18 plus 8 is 26 so 261 is the required product 29 now following these two we are writing the dodging tables of 31 to 39 i have so many numbers here 31 to 39 and i am writing the tables uh, in, in intermediate numbers say 31 to 7 32 into 4 33 into 9 34 into 6 and 39 into 6 now let us learn this method it is as easy as these two methods now what we do is this number 7 is to be tripled that is multiplied by 3 so 7 3 is a 21 then put a 0 and multiply this by the units place 7 1 the 7 and add the two numbers you get the dodging table result of 31 into 7 again say we have to multiply 32 into 4 just write the triple of 4 that is 12 put a 0 and multiply 4 by 2 8 128 is the result it takes only 2 seconds to write any dodging table from 31 to 39 see 33 into 9 9 3 is a 27 put a 0 and 9 3 is a 27 add the two results 297 is the product 6 6 3 is a 18 put a 0 
six fours are twenty four. Add the two results, two zero four. Five. I'm sorry, eight. Triple of eight is twenty four. Put a zero. Eight five is a forty. The result is two eighty. Three. Triple of three is nine. Put a zero. Six into three is eighteen. Answer is one zero eight. Triple of five is fifteen. Put a zero. Seven five is a thirty five. Add the two results. One eighty five is the final result. Seven triple of seven is twenty one. Put a zero. Seven eight is a fifty six. Add the two. Two hundred and sixty six is the result. Triple of six is eighteen. Put a zero. Nine six is a fifty four. Add the two. Two hundred and thirty four is the result. So this method has to be told to the children right from the basic age of eight years, nine years, so that they can write all the dodging tables. And whenever they confront these calculations in higher mathematics, they can do it with ease. So keep learning, keep sharing, and subscribe the channel. Recommend it to your friends if you like it.